All right, we have here, folks, a quantum strato power chair. This is the strato. Now, this chair here, folks, I'm going to tell you ahead of time, it's going to be sold with this seat on here. So, even though the base right here from wheel to wheel is 22 inches, but from arm to arm is 25 inches. So, your seat is wider than your base. Okay, so don't go by the manual. Even though this says 22, we are keeping this seat on this chair. So, the seat on this chair. It, from outside of arm, outside of arm is 25 inches. That's the magic number going through your door. So if you better have a 27 inch door or more, and this will go through it with no problem at all. So this is a uh, Quantum Edge 3 Stretto. Uh, it has 14 inch wheels, solid. They will not mark your floor. You have suspension all the way around. You have a shock like this on every corner. Every, every fork has its own independent fork, uh, independent suspension, okay? You have also on this chair an anchor point right here, and you have another one right here. So you have four anchor points to secure your chair to your lift or to your van, okay? You also have a motor for each wheel has its own independent motors, okay? So if I want to push this chair right now, I can't push it because it probably weighs 300 pounds. But if I turn the power off, do it again, turn the power off, push the yellow lever down, what that does, it unlocks my wheel. You have to do both motors on both sides, and then you're ready to, and this one's real easy to push, as you can see. So if you had to move it around, you could just push it easily. When you're done, make sure at the end of the day, after you've moved it, put it back in gear, okay? So, um, so that's how you put it in neutral with the motors on both sides with the power off, okay? I'm gonna turn the power back on. So this chair here, as I said, it's a Quantum S3 Stretto. It has a seat on here of 19 inches by 21 deep. So it's, a, it's set up for a fairly tall person. 21 deep, 21 wide, I'm sorry, 19 wide by 21 deep. And it's got gel back here and foam in the front and it's contoured. You can see how my hands are contoured. These foot plates do not move, but you can flip them up when you exit. This chair has a really good turning radius, so it turns on its own length. So if you watch this, and you can see how quiet it is. So it turns on its own length. So if you want a real quiet chair. So this is a, a small power chair. It's, I don't want to say it's extra, it's, it's a little bit smaller than medium. It only has a, a small base, a real short turning radius. It has a decent sized seat though, but we're keeping the seat on this chair, so this is going to make someone a perfect chair if you don't need anything like for tilting, reclining. Now, you do have a captain's seat on here. I forgot to mention this earlier. So a captain's seat, you would have a handle right here where you can flip the seat back and forth. So you can recline it this way, or you can go all the way down like this. So if you're transporting this chair in your minivan or any, any SUV, Usually you'll have 34 to 36 inches. Right here is about 32 inches. From the top of this joystick to the, to the that's your highest point. It's gonna be about 32 inches. So we're, we're at, where I lied, we're about 31 inches. So 31 inches right here. So that gives you plenty of room to get in the back of an SUV if you're gonna ramp it up because the seat can fold down. Some of the seats only go down this far and you can't get into a minivan that way. So, <clears throat> you do have a swing away on this one also. You can swing the joystick away from the front. If you're left-handed, we'll put the joystick on the outside and it'll swing to the left side. This chair is equipped with headlights and tail light. There's a little switch here. If I hit it, you can see the headlights and you can see the tail lights. I'm not saying you can go down the highway with those lights, but you, get, you definitely get to go down to your hallway at your home at nighttime in a dark house, it'll light up your whole room, okay? So you have the rear lights and the front lights on this chair. These are factory lights. We're gonna turn the lights off. The arms on this chair do flip up. So if you exit from the side, you can flip the arms up. And they can also be adjusted up and down. There's a little Allen screw right here. You just go in here, turn it off, and you can raise, we can raise these arms up any height that you want. They can also be adjusted on this angle to whatever angle you want. It's all adjustable there. So, <clears throat> the back of the chair, we have a pouch. 
And that's about it. And you have a headrest that can be removed. So if you want to remove the headrest, it goes up and down, or you can completely remove it. Um, when you charge this chair, you'll take the charger provided with the chair. I'm going to use this charger for example. So when you charge it, you just plug your cable at the bottom of your joystick and as soon as the light on this charger goes from orange to green, you're fully charged. These chargers will stop charging automatically when the batteries are full. So these are smart chargers. They know how to uh, charge and stop charging when your batteries are full. So folks, this chair has a 300 pound weight capability. It's built solid. Just remember the arms are 25 inches from outside to outside of arm. You have the swing away joystick. The cushion is 21 wide, uh, 19 wide by 21 deep. You have a captain's seat that can be folded down. You have a headrest. You have the lights, solid tires, suspension all the way around. Again, this is the Quantum Edge Stretto. And this power chair folk does not have a meter, so we can only go by the tires. It was probably used about three or four months. It's in practically new condition. There's no wear on the back tires. About three or four months of usage on this one. So really nice power chair. If you just need a nice large captain seat with a good turning radius in your home, this one would probably work well. This is the Quantum Stretto. Top speed is about six miles an hour. When you let go of the joystick, it stops automatically. So if I let go, you can see how it comes to a stop. So great power chair, great suspension. If you need a chair with electric tilt, electric recline, electric legs, this would be a really nice power chair. Uh, almost no miles on this one. Remember the seat stays the way it is on this chair. So your, your arms are 25 inches from outside to outside arm with the seat being, I think it was 19 by 19 seat, okay? Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We're co-owners of Mark's Mobility. I started this company in 1995. We sell many products, not just what you see in this video. If you have any questions or concerns, please call us at the number below at 800-677-6293. Thank you and have a wonderful day.